Welcome back to another video. As always, my name is Jasper, and what we're going to be covering today is how to create the typewriter effect on Bubble. Now, this is extremely easy and can be done in seconds. So, what we're going to need is a Bubble application, as you can see we've got here. So, it says typewriter effect. That's just a simple text um, within a group. And then, if we come across, what we're going to be using is the type, uh, the typer.js package, and this is actually going to allow us to have the effect. So first what we've got to do is come across to your actual bubble application and we're going to add in an HTML block. So we're going to put that right here and then we're also going to let it be as wide as it needs to go. So we go like that and then we're going to come back across to the typewriter here and we're going to grab the script and this is going to be the script right here. So this is how it access the actual package and we're going to put that within the actual HTML block. So that's before the text. So we'll put it there, so it knows that's a piece of script. And now we've actually got what it has here. This is the text and how it works. So what I'll do is I'll copy this to make it a bit easier to see. We're gonna then bring it across to this application. Let's go here, paste it in, there we go. Let's go HTML editor. So as you can see, we've got the script and it says, it's got a paragraph here and it goes, I enjoy, and it's got span. And then it's got a selection of words here, apples, oranges, blueberries, and then it can also change colors, but let's just remove the color change as we don't need that. So let's say we've got the class, the delay, so that's how long it takes to make the change, and the words, that's it. So let's save. And as you can see, it's already working within the um, preview itself. So it goes, I enjoy blueberries, <clears throat> and then it goes, then it'll change and it'll say I enjoy apples. But let's go to preview to take a look ourselves. And there you have it. So it's using the text and it's automatically changing. But let's say what if you wanted to change it to something else. So let's come back across. we are going to HTML editor. So let's say instead we wanted to say I am a bubble.io and then it will stop there. And then we'll change these to say developer. And then this word will be designer. And then the last word we'll make it expert. And let's go save. Come back across. We'll refresh. And it goes I am a bubble developer. I am a bubble designer. And I am a bubble expert. So just like that, in seconds, you can get this typewriter effect just using the HTML element and then inputting the script and then the little paragraph that you'll find here. Now, all this will be in the description of this video. Um, and also, just so everyone knows, I have now launched uh, memberships as well. So you'll be able to take a look at that and see, uh, that's YouTube memberships. So you'll be able to see the sort of uh, things you can get with it. I have created a Discord group as well uh, for these memberships where you can communicate with me and the team and um, we can yeah answer any questions you may have. But if you want to take a look um, at that, that'd be cool. Um, I'll also link that in the comment section. Thanks for watching this video and look forward to seeing you on the next one.